हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो विल डिस्कस आइसोमेट्रिक व्यू ऑफ स्क्वायर बेस प्रिज्म हैविंग बेस एज 60 60 मीटर से 60 एमएम एंड हाइट 80 एमएम बेस एज इज 60 एंड हाइट इज 80 तो आई होप यू हैव सीन द प्रीवियस वीडियो ऑफ आइसोमेट्रिक व्यू ऑफ स्क्वायर बेस पिरामिड तो 50% ऑफ द प्रोसीजर विल रिमेन सेम so in this case again first let's draw one reference line it should be a continuous thin line let's select this one as a pole point align your protector with this point and this reference line and mark the angle of 30 degree both sides 0, 10, 20 and 30 degree 30 degree this side and similarly 30 degree this side both the sides the angle is exactly 30 degree so the base edge is 30 sorry base edge is 60 mm 60 mm so first we will draw two lines of 60 mm both the sides Sixty mm. Similarly, this side. So this is sixty mm both sides. So in case of square, all these sides are same. So if this is sixty on this side also, we need sixty. So let's copy this dimension. take 60 from this side and 60 are from this side now we'll create the third base edge of the square base prism this is the fourth base edge so these all these sides are 60 mm so 60 mm base edge is ready now we'll construct the height of the object so this is the third isometric line this is first one 30 degree right 30 degree left and now third one is vertical line so we'll take the height of 80 mm from all the four vertices height will be always a vertical line so take care for this line 80 mm take 80 mm from the side up to this point it is 80 now similarly from this third vertex 1 2 this is let's say third and this is fourth so from all the four vertices you have to take the height of 80 mm now from this vertex vertex also So from all the four vertices we have taken the height of 80 mm so this is the first this is height from second corner height from third corner and height from fourth corner join all the endpoints you can draw the continuous thick line here because top surface will be clearly visible to you
now now we got the same rhombus rhombus means to say isometric view of a square at the height of 80 mm now we have to generate the side edges of the prism these all the lines are continuous thick lines this is the base edge which will be visible from the front and side right so there is no need to erase this line you can keep this line basically these are the hidden edges so in isometric view generally we are not preparing the hidden lines so you can just keep these lines just to show the construction work let's go for dimensioning so for dimensioning again you have to use the 30 degree extension lines there is no need to use the protector again this line is already at 30 degree take the extension take the extension line from this point now here you have to mark the dimension line So you can see the scale is parallel to this line. If the scale is parallel to the edge, means the line will be at thirty degree. Similarly, from here, align your scale with this base edge. Now the angle is thirty degree. Take extension line. This is height. So height should be always a vertical line. Here you can write the dimensions of the object. You can see here only three lines are there, three isometric lines are there: thirty degree towards right, thirty degree towards left, and vertical line. as per align style the dimension should be written above the line and perpendicular to dimension line this is 60 and this height is 80 if you have any doubt or any question please post your comments thank you so much and please subscribe to the channel